young players. That hasn't necessarily materialised. Arsene Wenger saying they are on the bench, they are available at some stage today, but one today should be goals, but they haven't got many goals this season. That's why they've gone with three central strikers in the attack. So without a win domestically, they obviously turned to Europa League for some confidence and they've gone with a very, very talented trio up top that you would expect would score goals domestically and in European competition, they can cause a lot of problems. To top the group heading into the final match day. Yeah, obviously some big changes from their big North London derby at the weekend. Arsene Wenger has gone with experience and surprised everybody. Ospina and Kohl's, a back three. Nabushi Holden and Mertesak, who is back the German World Cup winner on German soil. Four in midfield are very talented, but up top there is goals for this Arsenal side. Welcome back to Danny Welbeck. We're hoping they can stay a little bit longer. It is Arsenal who kick things off. Danny Welbeck back in the side for Wiltshire. Nice little flick ball in behind. Early opportunity here for Arsenal then. Horn has to come out quickly. It was Ainsley Maitland-Niles making a very good attacking run. It's a lovely bus forward from Danny Welbeck. This little touch in behind from Jack Walsh. Maitland-Niles continuing. And a little bit of space for Cordoba. It opens up for the Colombian. Tries to go for goal and Ospina has to make a very good save against his counterpart. Excellent movement from Cordoba and stopped by another Colombian. It's almost as if he was caught in two minds as to what to do with the strike. John Cordova, should he try to cross? He had a little glance over to his left hand. So does well, still not fully cleared. Maybe a chance to go for goal here. The hit goes straight at Moreau. Another long range hit, and that one just wide. Not a noted goal scorer, Coughlin, but he wasn't far away there. Yeah, it just felt kindly. Coughlin striking from distance, it's not far away. Timo Horn looked like he might have just had it covered. And signed on a couple of occasions now. Back to Niles, a little chip delivery. Wiltshire in the area and the downward header. Easy save in the end for Horn. But once again, it's Arsenal doing all the offensive work. What a chance. This is a good delivery. And actually, Jack Wilshire should be doing a lot better with his header. Arrives perfectly to him. No real pressure on the head. History on that day. I'm hoping for a win today and prolong this day in European competition. Nice. Osako on the turn, tries to go for goal and... We like the confidence from the striker, but that one's well, well wide. Yes, yeah, a disappointing finish in the end from Osaka, but so far Arsenal, they look pretty dangerous. To Giroud, and it's a very good run forward, two inside the area, and the chance, and it's off the woodwork. The closest we've come to a goal. Lovely build-up play on that left-hand side again, and it's Coughlin, the holding midfielder, who timed his run to perfection. Holbeck pulls it back away from Klunter. Can he go for goal? Cold effort. And Giroud had made a run into the six-yard box, and... Was close to getting on the end of that. Well, I just wonder if he pulled his leg away from this one. Olivier Giroud. Nice, nice delivery. He's not far away at all, Giroud, from making contact with that ball. Zasako. Oh, my fall kindly. And Garassi in position at the edge of the box. And just snatches at the chance. It opened up just for a moment for the young striker. It's almost as if he's waiting for this ball to get to him rather than just fully attacking him. Just waiting patiently. And that's not aggressive out of him. Grassi tries to link with Jojic. Still Grassi goes in, goes to ground, and the referee's going to give a penalty. Massive decision. And well, maybe this is the break Cologne have been looking for. Well, it came from the danger man, Grassi, causing all sorts of problems this time around, utilizing his aggression to get there first. And there is a clear challenge, and it's a strong, strong challenge. He'll see it. Garassi against Ospina. Senu Garassi, and he's found the back of the net. They've offered very little going forward in this game, but Cologne amazingly find themselves the goal up on Arsenal. Well, Arsenal have absolutely dominated this game as far as possession and creativity goes, but Garassi stepped up with a moment of brilliance to win that penalty kick and also showed the confidence to step up and brilliance to win that penalty kick. Maitland-Niles making a good run forward, still Wiltshire. He'll go for goal. Good save from Horn. He had to get down sharply to his left-hand side. and Very good approach play and the end product as well from Wiltshire. Well, he's got the quality, Jack Wiltshire, to pull. And lovely ball in behind. Giroud, Timo Horn off his line. And again, that first touch just going away from Olivier Giroud. And potential injury issue here for Timo Horn as well. Well, just caught defensively. Sorensen looked like he might have just played Olivier Giroud on site. Here that caught in a 
one possession right there, and he's forced to rely heavily on Yanis Horn to recover for him. The first touch looked like it was brilliant from him here. But what about this ability? That is absolutely top draw from him. The final ball lets them down. Arsenal sending numbers forward again. Wiltshire from distance!